missing that key player on your team and do not have the coins to afford them, make sure you check out Buy Mug Coins for instant Madden coins and always use code SAVAGE for 10% off. Yo guys, what's going on? It's Savage here. Welcome back to another Madden 19 Ultimate Team video. And today, guys, is the official debut of 98 overall Randy Moss and 98 overall Patrick Peterson. I am so excited. A lot of you guys are pumped for this. A lot of you guys have been like, yo, Savage, we need the Randy and Pat P gameplay. Well, here it is. Before we hop into our game, though, gotta flex these stats for you guys really quick. Six foot four, 99 speed, 98 jump, 97 catch, 95 catch in traffic, 99 spec catch, 93 short route 95 medium route 99 deep route running absolutely insane and dude patrick peterson he's looking like a golden ticket too man this card is absolutely insane bro 97 speedy 6-1 94 excel 97 agility 98 jumping which is a huge stat on corners 94 play right 99 man 97 zone 94 press this card is actually insane as well man unbelievable cards man guys if you could so kindly beings that we did not take the training route and we actually went ahead and we bought both of their limiteds i spent 915k on pat pete and on stream the other night i sniped randy moss for 1,500,000 coins totaling 2,415k spent that's a lot of freaking coins if you guys could man smack a big fat thumbs up on the button i really really would appreciate it man because i know you guys have been wanting the cards well guess why here it is man i'm super excited but I'm going to stop rambling and bambling now. Make sure you go ahead and comment down below. Did you guys pick up any of these beasts? And of course, if you're new around here and want to join the Savage Squad, make sure you click that subscribe button. Because guess what? We're about to hop into this game and we're about to flex with these dudes. Let's get it. All right, guys. Here we go. Starting off on the defense. So you guys get to watch Patrick Peterson in action. Patrick Peterson's up here for anybody who's like, yo, Savage, where's Patrick Peterson? Here comes Pat P trying to lock up the run. And yes, he does. Patrick Peterson able to jam that run up. Him and Javon Kurz getting the tackle. Two yard loss for our opponent right here and believe it or not weirdly enough this guy's top three was 99 vic and 98 mcnab and then some i think 97 ray lewis or something dude that's so random i don't know why you have two like freaking amazing qbs on your team it seems like he's going with vic as his starter but hey man more power to him let's see what he decides to do right here on the second and 12 oh and everything is locked up and i didn't get a user animation mm -hmm. for some weird reason bro like I really don't know why. I just feel like I can't use her like I used to be able to. I used to be able to lurk everything, man. And now for some weird reason, I just can't do it like I used to. And right there, Ricky Williams is running into his own blocker, falling forward for zero yards. Only a matter of time before he is forced to actually make a read. And I think right here is where he's going to make his read. Motioning over that tight end. Or I'm watching him, man. We got Pat Pete manned up on Randy. Randy is manned up by Patrick Peterson. And freaking Pat Pete was on him like glue, allowing the coverage sag, dog. I'm down. I like coverage sacks. That is going to bring up a fourth and 18. He is electing to punt the ball. It's time to bring out Randy. Okay, guys, here we go. Now we are on offense. It is our Randy Moss's turn to get involved. Let's see what he decides to do right here on this first down. He is blitzing the crew. Blitz in the crew. Ricky Williams in the flat. So that's not a that's not a bad play at all. He just ran a play called freaking zero blitz. So if this dude is willing to just blitz that many people. I'm guaranteed to be able to hit him over the top once with Randy. He's once again is calling the zero blitz. Let's see what he decides to do. Oh, no, that actually wasn't zero blitz. I, I don't know what that was, but we just hit Keyshawn Johnson on the playmaker, dude. Got to see what that was. Zero blitz again with coverage. This dude is interesting. It looks like he's just turning like a coverage shell into the backside of this play that he's running. Um, it's definitely unique because I've never really seen anybody run this play in general, to be honest. We're going to lead pass it right here to Randy Moss. 99 speed Randy Moss. Jeez, man. Getting us down right to the 12. We're inside the red zone just like that. Um, I, I don't really think he's going to succeed too much if he does have this weird blitz mentality against me. But who knows, man? Maybe he, he, he could be onto something. Let's see. Going to have Randy Moss running a nice little deep in route right here. Let's see what he decides to do. I'm waiting. I'm waiting. We have Randy Moss. I'm just literally trying to force feed Randy. Pretty sure Tyree Kill on that last play was wide open for a touchdown, but we just didn't throw it because you want to know why? Randy. Randy Moss is why. We are going to force feed Randy as much as we possibly can. And oh my goodness, Randy breaking. Randy Moss is wide open, man. Let's go, dude. Randy Moss 
Beats man coverage right there. I'm pretty sure he manned up Eric Berry, which is an instant mismatch. Not only because Eric Berry doesn't have like the highest man coverage stats, but Eric Berry don't got 99 speed. Let's go. Right here, this guy is once again coming out in a very run heavy set, but I'm cool with that because Patrick Peterson, dude, beings that we are manning him up he is just going to immediately crash and once again patrick peterson recording another solo tackle i know a lot of people always like yo savage why do you play corners at safety i like speed up there i don't like to get beat over the top and i know that patrick peterson and Deion sanders extremely athletic extremely glitchy and if you click on with those players dude and you go in for the solo tackle with your user you're going to be able to make more plays. You're not going to risk getting user trucked. You're not going to risk getting user spun out. You're not going to risk getting user uh, juked. You're going to be able to make those plays because you are clicking on and usering the defender. And that is something that a lot of people are normally really scared to do. But guys, I promote it, bro. I definitely say click on if you can. Let's see what we got right here. Final play of the first quarter. Yes, he is snapping the football. He is snapping the football. And Patrick Peterson just undercut the baby in route. Pat Pete, Pat Pete almost going to the house, man. Vic was the only player who could catch him because Vic is probably just as fast as him. But what a play. All right, man, this is probably going to be a cover three shell. So I got to watch it. Got to watch it. Got to watch it. Got to watch it. Dude, that's wide open. And Michael Vick sails it out the back of the end zone. You know me, man. I got to I gotta freaking go for it. Oh, man, even though this Mike Vick hits every threshold, dude, he misses throws that he probably should not be missing normally. But that's okay, though, because we're just going to chuck it up. And we're going to let Randy be great. And Randy gets hit as he's coming down with it. We unfortunately do not get any points. What he decides to do right here, man. Second and one. He's going back to the stretch. Going back to the stretch. Patrick Peterson recording another tackle for a loss. All of his tackles are tackles for losses. Patrick Peterson is insane, man. Even though Patrick Peterson might necessarily not be in real life the greatest run support cornerback, dude. In Madden, he is the epitome of just what a cornerback should be. He's so good. And, dude, freaking love him. I love him. I love him. Probably going to run baby out routes right here of some sort. If he comes out in IZ, I'd be impressed. Let's see what he decides to do right here. He's going to go to the tight end. And we hit stick him. Did he come down with the? Yes, he did. I'm actually really impressed that Zachary Ertz was able to come down with that. Actually, I mean, I guess Ertz comes down with those passes, man, when he has Carson throwing to him. Let's see what we got right here. Deion Sanders over the top. Are we good? This dude is just making it so obvious that he wants to run it. He's just hurting himself by running, if that makes any bit of sense. So we got right here, though. We are going to run with this Zachary Ertz. Oh, my. Did he catch that? Patrick Peterson able to somehow make a play on that ball. No idea how he did it, but we love him for that. We're going to do something that we did not do one time this game so far, and that is just send an immense amount of heat right here. See what he's doing, man. It is going to be 4th and 14. I have to send the heat. I have to send the heat. I have to send the heat. He's going for the low ball. Incomplete. Incomplete pass. Let's go. Jack Tatum on the coverage. All right, man. First and 10 right here. Let's see what he decides to do. What is he doing? He's leaving Randy Moss unattended. Randy Moss going up with one hand, bringing it down in the beautifulest of fashions. I'm going to let Randy run the route that he's supposed to be on right here. Let's see what he decides to do on this first and 10 that he just blessed us with look at Tyreek Hill we are going to bring him back around the other way oh my goodness we just diddled his entire defense right there with the playmaker then we used the one cut mechanic and we cut right back look at oh on a dime man Eric Berry had no clue where to go right there now it is going to be the freaking danger zone we are highballing it to Randy Moss or bust let's see what Randy can do baby let's see what can Randy do Randy dude my michael vick broken or can he just not highball in the red zone dude i was highballing in the red zone fine all weekend long see we got right here randy and he just that the one time that vick throws it accurately i i get covered at the last possible second are you kidding me vick dude you have him wide open and you throw it like a freaking idiot dude all right here we go fourth and goal we're going for it because this guy doesn't know how to play offense and we don't really care what happens see what we got though let's see what we got we got randy back in the end zone he goes up with one hand and it's too freaking high because mike vick is a noodle head not even randy moss who's doing bad it's just freaking vick is a freaking noodle man i don't get why he's being the way he is right now but it's making me sad oh my good oh i just threw a pick dude what 
I'm playing like a noodle now, dude. This is what happens when Mike Vick aggravates me, bro. I freaking start playing like a freaking idiot head. All right, let's see what we got right here, though. Let's see. We're ba bagging, 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 bagging. That's a pick. Thank you for it right back, dude. You wasted you wasted your chance. Now, actually, nah, he probably didn't waste his chance because I'm going to freaking get down to the red zone, be a head ass, high ball three times a Vic, and miss it every single time. Why can't I just force feed my Randy Moss? Like, does this kid realize, like, that, like, I just want Randy Moss to be open and I can just run the ball like this all game, but I'm not because I'm a nice person? All right, dude, literally everybody is running vertical. Let's see what we have right here. We have uh, Ricky Williams on the catch. I'm going for it because, dude. I'm just trying to, I just want, I just want Randy to do good. That's all I want. That is literally all I want right now. Can Randy Moss please just do good? Yes or no? We're about to find out. Uh, we got a wide open Franco Harris that's just going to come across the formation. He's going to run. And look, we're going to get right here. This is high ball territory. Can Vic complete the high ball pass? Vic, all I need you to do, Randy Moss, one-on-one, -on -one, yummy in my tummy. Let's get it, bro. Let's get it, Vic. Let's get it, Vixter. Let's get it, Vixter. Let's get it, Vixter. Vixter on the run. Fine a freaking lead, man. Dude, how the heck can you complete that pass? How can you complete? But when you have a clean pocket and Randy Moss is wide open, you throw it in the row 14 to Tommy. How? How are you doing that, Vic? I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Oh, my goodness, man. EA definitely knew I was making a vid because they did not want my Michael Vic to succeed. But we finally did it, man. We were able to show off Randy and Pat Pete all in one video. Randy had nice, uh, nice two touchdowns. Pat Pete had the nice little pick and, like, six or seven tackles or something crazy. And they were all for losses, so that's definitely dope. You can see how good he is in the run support. One and all in the brand new season. I hope you guys all did enjoy. If you did, smack a big fat thumbs up on the butt, man. Hope you all have a wonderful rest of your night. As always, guys.